my name is Dr. William Nort. I'm an orthopedic surgeon and knee joint replacement specialist. I'm here to talk to you about some really new, exciting technology we have to offer at Param Doctors Hospital. Really one of the bigger leaps in technology we've had in joint replacement surgery in quite some time. And the whole concept is to um, put a total knee replacement in as accurate um, and as well balanced as possible. And this new technology has really helped us to do that a lot. A CT scan is taken of the knee. Uh, the CT scan is downloaded into our computer program. Uh, and we're left with uh, a picture like this where we start. Uh, the landmarks of your actual knee are placed. So we go from a screen where we see the patient's native knee and three dimensionality. Um, and that's what the CT scan of the knee, the CAT scan of the knee allows us to do. It's imported into our program. And then based upon the patient's actual landmarks, we will build a virtual knee replacement. The importance of this technology is it allows us um, really three aspects of uh, improving how we do knee replacements. And our goal is the perfect knee replacement. Um, whether or not that's attainable is uh, somewhat arguable, but this technology allows us to get closer and closer and closer to what we will hope will be a perfect knee. By perfect knee, we say a knee that feels like a normal knee. That is, is you ask the patient a year after surgery, have you had a knee replacement? And they say, my knee feels normal. Feels like a normal knee. That is our goal. There are really three things that this technology allows us to do. It allows us to put in the absolute correct size of knee. Um, we have hundreds of variations of components that we can mix and match to get the patient the right size. And we know ahead of time what's going to be the ideal size for a patient. It allows us to put the knee in with the hopefully perfect alignment. And then lastly, it helps us to balance the knee, put the knee in with the perfect balance. It's been a great advent. It's certainly been important to my practice. Um, once you have all these numbers that you can actually measure, that you can quantitate, and then we can look at what we found during the patient's surgery and review that a year later or two years later based upon how well the patient are doing, and that changes everything. So if I see 100 patients who had their knee put in with certain parameters and that um, 70 of them are doing exceptionally well and 30 of them are doing fairly well, we want to find the difference between the exceptionally well and the fairly well patients, and this is, allows us to do this. So we keep getting better and better and better. Um, you can't manage what you can't measure, and this technology allows us to measure everything we do at the time of surgery.